Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Spencer here, showing you guys how to embed live streams and YouTube videos into your website. Now, it's very simple, and all it takes is some copy and paste. Or, if you want to hand type it, you can. But, what you're going to want to do is, I'm going to start off with Twitch, and I'm going to use my Twitch for this. But, for the Twitch live stream, it's going to be Twitch, Hitbox, and YouTube, of course. But, you're going to want to grab your camera from your Twitch, and then your chat from your Twitch, and then just copy and paste them. Now I recommend only copying and pasting them instead of typing them, just because it's a lot faster, it's simpler, and yeah, it's pretty easy. So that's going to be the video, and you're going to want to hit enter so it doesn't all connect and be kind of misformed and stuff, and you're going to want to grab your chat first, okay? And then I'll show you guys how you're going to want to connect them. Control V again with that. And then you're going to go to design if you're using this, and you're just going to drag it up. And if you're not using Dreamweaver, it should automatically set it up how it is right now. And let's just go ahead and go live with this. And you'll see the video is right there. Awesome. Okay, so that's all good. Now you're going to want to exit out of this, and you're going to go over here again and you're gonna pretty much just go to design or code and you're gonna hit enter behind your chat and the next we're gonna embed is the YouTube video so I'm gonna use mine for an example it's pretty easy to do and you're just gonna click this and I'm gonna have mine set to 1280 by 720 but it's whatever you guys choose and then you can also go 640 by 360 which is the standard and then if you want to use your uh, old embedded code, say you already have some but you forgot how, what it looks like or how to do it because it's been a while, then you can just click on that. But I like the simple new one and then show suggested videos if you want it. But I don't use it at all that much. And then you're just going to click copy. Once you get it all selected, copy. Go to Dreamweaver or whatever text editor you're using. Control V. If you're using Windows, I think it's uh, the same for Mac. And then you're all good. Let's check this out on uh, the Design tab. And voila, there's your YouTube video. And you can also use the center tag and stuff to center the video if you want it to be your div. If you want to add a whole new style to it. But I'm just going to leave it as is for right now. And then what you're going to want to do for Hitbox is you're just going to come down here. And then you see I already have it pasted in right here, just because Hitbox is a bit different. They don't actually give you your code, like, right off the bat. You can't just instantly share it. You actually have to get the code for it and type it in on your own. So what I did here is I did iframe, and then I did width as equals quotations, and then I did 640, and then end quotation. And then I did height equals quotation 360 and quotation. And then source, SRC equals quotation HTTP colon forward slash two of them hit box or hit box dot TV slash Hash, or hashtag exclamation point slash embed forward slash and then whatever your username so I'll just put mine in there you go and then just do end quotation frame border equals quotation zero and quotation and then most people want to allow full screen so I'm just gonna do allow full screen and then you're gonna want to end it like that and then just do another iframe or end and closing tag okay so that is how to get the video to load, so I'll show you guys what it looks like with just the video. That would be where the video is right here. And then what you're going to want to do to get the chat also is you're going to want to press enter. 
and then just do pretty much the same thing. The only difference is instead of having embed normal video, it's going to be embed embed chat. Okay, so Control V because I already ha oh no Control Z actually. Um, Control C and then Control V and then you're just going to change this from embed to embed chat. So it's pretty simple. And you're also going to want to change the uh, height too. So it's going to be 360 by 640 instead of 640 by 360. Oh, 60 by 640. And it's pretty easy. Like that. Now that's all for you guys today. I hope you guys had fun watching this video. I hope you guys learned something. Maybe you guys can bring your website to its full potential. And I'll talk to you guys next time. Thank you.